right, ciao, ciao. Man, check this. Look at this view. We're just a little bit outside of Novi Sad here in Fruscogora. And they call this little area, uh, like, where eagles fight. And there's my two two friends there, Gino and Philip, showing me around. Man, isn't this beautiful? But they call it, like, eagles, this little site here. You've got, like, little uh, benches, a gazebo over there, this fence, places where eagles fight. That's the, the uh, tower that was bombed in 1999, unfortunately. God, isn't it gorgeous? Just right outside of Novi Sad, not far at all. And you've got all of this. Whip. Fruska, Gora, my friends. <laughs> Šta brate moj? Priča s ingleski. No, ne. Ti? There's my boys. Da, ti priča srpski. Ne brate moj. Mrzim priča. And it's gorgeous though. No other people. We haven't stumbled into anybody. Really cool temperatures. Man, it's pretty out here. All right outside of Novi Sad. 15 minutes, you know? And it's like you're in a totally different world here. Check this out, look at this. This is a lake we came to, or a pond. I would call it a pond, but look at that, man. Look at this, when you reach in here. <laughs> look at that. Like 10 million tadpoles. Kako se kaže na srpskom? Puno glavci. Puno glavci. So many of them in here. I first go is gorgeous. <laughs> okay, so here's what we did. Okay, here in Frisco Gora, it's like a hundred and eight square miles or two hundred and sixty six. Eh, I don't remember thousand square kilometers I, I don't remember anyway 108 square miles and we are like right here we went clear through here and this is one of the most beautiful places that's where I made that video uh, that's where we were where you saw that where the eagles fight uh, there we walked through there back through here over here to the Yezero and back, man. That was nice. All in. That's ah, only not even noon yet. Really good timing. Fun place. It's gorgeous out here. Okay, check this place out. They got chicken, Murek. They got potatoes. Not much more. Doesn't that look good? Okay, check this. Chicken. Smothered in what is that? Kaima uh yogurt. Yogurt. Mm. Okay, here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, how you doing? Charles here. Today is Friday, May 8th, day 52, three of my quarantine. I didn't make a video yesterday uh, because it was the first day of pure freedom. Uh, so I went to Fuscogora, me and my buddy Gino and Kako Sezone, uh, Philip, we went to Fuscogora, had an absolute blast. And yesterday, I live in Donaska Ulitsa, you know. And so yesterday was the first time, it was actually refreshing to hear noise, you know. I heard noise all day, even at night. By the time I got home and laid down to go to bed, it was like, I don't know, two, two-ish and still noise outside, so it was actually, I slept better, you know, better than pure silence. So it was great, and, and today is Friday, like I said, it's currently about 3.30. I just smoked here with my Russian friend who's holding this phone, a uh, friend of mine, Dan's here. You can see the city, uh, there's quite a few people, uh, but not like a massive amount that I expected. Gorgeous day outside, you know, maybe a little bit chilly, uh, but the bars are like, Oh, that little section over there, they got like six people at that table. 
uh, which you're not really supposed to have. I think it's still supposed to be four, right, Damien? It's supposed uh, to be two. I think. Oh, two. Yeah, yeah. they're supposed to be with two people, with uh, two meters in between or something, something like that. But people like the, the bar next door. Show them over there, the Mazu. It's not like a billion people out and about, and all the shops still. When you go into like the grocery store or something like that, there's still a lot of people that are wearing the masks. Like I asked him, because I, I didn't know there's like signs on the front of the stores, and I didn't know if it actually said you have to wear the mask, but I went into the store today to get some stuff this morning, and everybody had a mask except me, so I felt kind of bad. Uh, but I just ran in quick. I saw everybody else had one, so I grabbed two things and went and checked out and left. Uh, but walking around the city, I mean, a lot of people don't have masks on. Uh, the only frustrating thing, the outdoor bars are going and everything, but just me and my friend here, and this other guy was here, we've been here since one, about two and a half hours. Biggest freaking problem, something I forgot about, and I wish I could still forget about, is the gypsies here. We're literally here. I, I thought there was one coming right now, but uh, seriously, every five minutes we're talking, a little kid comes over, oh, Molly. Paul much, Paul much, bitch, you know, you get that all the time. Constant stream of people coming over for money, 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 money. Same kids, two and a half hours, the same boy came over three times. I gave him Shestessa Dinara and no more, you know. So that's the thing I wish I didn't have to experience again here in Serbia. But anyway, life's coming back to normal. And I'm going out tonight at five, I'm going to the bar, so I don't know what time I'll be home. So. I'll try to upload this video before because I'll probably be a little bit intoxicated afterwards. And that's it, my friends. Take care. Till Virginia. Okay, here we are walking home. It's like four. You see this place? Not that many people. Over there, uh, there's a few. People sitting on the benches, yeah. You got the balloons for the kids. You got Mr. Zmai Jovina. Jovan Jovanovic Zmai. That's the streets named after him. All these little things for kitties. It was cool the other day they had one with a mask. <laughs> More balloons. I mean, it's very family friendly here. If you haven't seen. Hey, ciao! Okay, I tried to show you, but I'm too popular. I know too many people. So every time I start making a video, I see somebody I know. He's one of the guys who works in Nantucket. But anyway, this is the street. Some people with masks, some without. And I'm getting ready to go to the bar. Yes, I'm Malo P. And I drank three beers. Uh, but this little cafe is usually full, but they don't have that many people. But I don't know. Gorgeous. We're slowly getting back to work here in Serbia.